right. Let's do some streaming. Oh, okay. That. Perfect. All right, guys. Time to jump back in to our Batanian campaign. All right, we got the air conditioner on. We're hanging out. You, on the other hand, are not hanging out. So look, see what we're doing today. Always standing stream, man. Always standing stream. Just that one off one where we did the sitting one. It'll pick up in due time. up giant smith oh uh, we'll get there we will get there guys so let's take a look here uh, we just took epicret uh, ep epicrotia ep epicroti epro epo papo people papa um and i mean our battalion empire is actually getting pretty sizable i mean if you kind of think about it we've taken a little bit of uh the northern empire we've taken a little bit of the western empire and we're doing pretty well aerodom thanks for the guides videos you create absolutely aerodom thank you very much for the two dollar donation man is it work? Is it working? Is it gonna work? I switched over to uh, to Streamlab Elements. Boom! It worked. A little high though, a little high. Go ahead and... Down a little bit. Okay. All right, cool. So that worked. Yeah, so I moved over to Streamlab Elements, or to Stream Elements, because apparently there was a problem with Streamlab donations. So if you guys are having a, were having a problem with Streamlab donations, I've hence I've now fixed it. Uh, there should be a link now in my description. Let me check to make sure that's the case. Oh, nope. There we go. But yeah, it's got like a custom page and everything too. So if you click the link in the description to to donate, I'm not saying I'm not saying hey, click it and donate. I'm saying you can see the custom page that it allows you to set up and everything. So it's actually pretty cool. Um, all these on and everything, cool. And it has like little timers that'll say like cool things. Like it's actually pretty sweet. All right, Zyphir, have a good one, dude. Thanks for popping in and out. Vlandia is strong in this one. You should see my Callard campaign. Vlandia is not too strong. Um, I think what I'm going to do is our next narrative campaign will be Sturgia. And our next stream campaign that we do on stream like this. Dude, oh my god, I didn't see this. Woo! Um, is going to be uh, Vlandia, I think. Hopefully, Aldox. Uh, in fact... If there's this patch today, we're going to switch to it and play the patch. What's up, Anwar? You, I, Ivan, you really have to, to do Sturgia right. You have to be the one that leads its forces. That's really how to do it properly, to be honest. Uh, like a major patch or patch that breaks all mods that like last week. Uh, a major patch, hopefully, Aradam. <laughs> a major patch, hopefully, my guy. <laughs> um, so, our goal here is to... Um, yeah, but uh, Mirko, they're supposed to push out a, a full patch. Dude, this looks just beautiful. Like, 
Let me see if it does. Can I get this to work? No. I, if I go and fix the, the thing, I can probably get it to work. Welcome to the, the lovely hills, the rolling hills of Calradia. Spend your weekend here on the frigid wasteland that is Sturgia. As you come across recently captured Vanavanapal, we move over to the Borjavorka uh, townstead. We sweep over the hills, riddled with forests and in innumerable amounts of dead bodies, we come to the lovely Epinoza Castle. Home of the Kissing Rock, Epinoza Castle is the heart of the land in between both the Northern Empire and Kazit. And as we move into Kazit, you can see the rolling deserts. It just kind of pockmark the land. Taken, the shining jewel of the land of Kazate. You see, that's what it should be, you know? It's a beautiful little uh, trip. <laughs> I did not yet, Grand, uh, uh, Great Graham. I have not yet. Okay, let's take a look at our army a little bit. Take a look. Kind of. We just got a pretty vicious little fight. Randall, you walked into the best thing. Okay, a lot, of, a lot of Winter Volunteers, some of the Pickled Warriors, some of the Osworn. Okay. Yeah, I, I think it's been kind of a, a quiet time here for a little bit in um, the, the wild world of uh, Bannerlord, just because of the, the, the fall off in between patches, but we do have patches coming. Remember, I've spoken to an internal beta tester. The stuff that's coming is supposed to be amazing. And the internal beta version is different than our version, obviously. We, they are ahead of the curve, though. So there are there's much to come. Um, I'll try the best I can, Ivan. I, it won't work out very well. <laughs> they did add new songs, Patrick. I did not do Sonic, my bro. Excuse me. Let's got that scout. And we have a lot of reinforcements, which is nice. We got 20 some odd units of reinforcement. You're going to come into our army, which will bring us about 80, uh, 281. Let's kind of move over here. The silversmith. Go pretty well for us. Capture him. Nothing like being on foot out running a caravan. Come on, come on. Or maybe not. Maybe we won't be able to. Yeah, third ambassador. Uh, my email is my uh, YouTube name at gmail.com. You can find it on my about page. This guy's like really hauling balls. In, in all honesty, he's going 6.4 and I'm not. Influence got nerfed again, Danny Quatch? Uh, Anwar, the diplomacy has been fixed as, as the last patch. Uh, fixed being a kind of loose statement, to be totally honest. Let me kind of get my bearings, so get my sea legs about me. Forward! Oh, we just loaded in, so we also have to change where our Falksmen are. No, they were added in um, Shadow Patch. I hope that does not turn that pick that catches on. <laughs> um, they were added in 1.4.1. Oops. Oh, the town's generating less influence. That's fine. The reason I did that was because I didn't want to send my fiends in and have them get killed. Oh, jeez. Alright, guys. Alright, so you're on two. Fenton's on one. Oh, everyone's got these lovely bear cloaks. 
Uh, I was gonna do someone from Kislev, Dahlia. We'll we'll see what I we'll see what I come up with. Three. My wife doesn't belong in three. What do my arrows look like? That oh um you can turn up the path so you can see them better. You can you can turn up the uh, the visibility of their arrow path, which is what I've done. Where are my my beaten up falksmen? Yeah, down to three. Unfortunately, we lost a lot in that last fight. Nope, I was not lucky, Wolfguard. <laughs> Let's get some more ponies though. Ooh. Come on, Anna, come up. The nice thing is a lot of those troops are out uh, romping and a stomping all over the place. Oh, we'll take them all. They're not going to sell all this. Sell a lot of it, though. But I don't have to pay anything for these. Your ponies. Actually, I'll sell it all. Yeah. They have just enough money. Bankrupting towns all throughout Batania. Well, bear calf is something I think we all wish we could have. Thanks, Paris. Dropping a two dollar donation. Oh, Ibris will never fall. Let's jump over here to these little uh, locations. Absolutely, third ambassador. If there's a specific question you want, you can feel free to ask it here, man. Mang, Mang is here. Great to see you streaming Bannerlord. I hope Tale Worlds can enable multiplayer custom battles like Total War Online battles. And dude, me too, Ming. I, I really can't wait. I want I want those sweet big custom battles. Thank you very much for your donation here today, guys. I know we're kind of going through a, a weird time in the world, and I, I really appreciate when you guys like like it's just so much overt support and it's so amazing, and I really, really appreciate it. I would never like Look down the nose at it, so I really, really think it's awesome. So, again, guys, thank you very much. Y'all mean so much to me. We're making hand over fist, tons of money here. Hmm. Damn. Thought we'd get, thought we'd get lucky. Hey, got a little luck there. By the way, I found this out today. Or not today, the other day. Boom, boom, nice. Okay, so you see this? Obviously we know that little uh, that little exclamation point means that I can that there's people that are either ready to upgrade or that there are um people that are that are ready to convert. Well if I hover over it, it says you have four new prisoners to recruit. I didn't know that was a thing. So I play this game for what, 300 hours now? And I still find things out. So that's why I think I have so much fun playing Bannerlord is because I'm constantly in situations where I'm like, wow, shit, I didn't even know that was a thing. That's awesome. Like, got these two as well. How close is Arion? We're almost there. Uh, you know Arion? Uh, uh, is it Ariane or Arion? I figure it's Arion because it looks like uh, you're very French. Brand is, Brand is my given name, but you can also call me... Ah, I'm sorry, dude. Ryan, I always forget that your name's Ryan. We got three Ryans in the track. Gr Great Graham, myself, and you. But thank you again for the, for the follow-up donation, dude. I appreciate it, man. Um, but you can... Um, I, I will probably do some lore, but right now it's so hard to find out the lore. Like... Uh, people were asking me, hey, where did I find the lore in the minor clans? Well, I clicked clans and went minor and clicked this. Roho of the Woods started as a Vlandian peasant movement, hiding out in the forest, robbing from the rich and giving to the poor. However, it encountered the problems that any long-running rebel movement might. It needed to ensure a steady supply of food and also ensure that none of the poor would dare earn a, bear, dare earn a bag of coins by informing on them. Slowly but surely, it began to, use, to make use of extortion, terror, and corrupt deals with the local authorities to survive, becoming little different from any other organized bandit group in Claradia. I can 
bastards. Um, even the major clans here. If I were to type, just press Valandia. Um, I can't remember which one. You like Bad Dermeric. You click Valandia, it doesn't really give you much on Valandia. It really kind of depends on which clan you look at, too. Even looking at... Empire seems to have some of the best fleshed out lore. Um, I guess active. Um... Here, we'll click Nerezes. There's nothing. But if I click Northern Empire, there's nothing. But I click Luzon, there's all this information. So it just depends sometimes. It's like, you. I want more information on the characters themselves. And there's there's a little bit more here on Durth, 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 Durthurt. But I want more on Valandia. Just Valandia. What's up, Vitsay? Wolfguard, now Incense Trader is uh, Incinerator to me. Thank you. You've now made that happen. We got a hundred people checking in here today. Nice. But how many likes do we have, bros? Only thirty-eight. <clears throat> Guys, need to be pumping up these likes. We need more. We need more thumbs. My favorite faction music. Um, I really like Kazate. <clears throat> of course, there we go. So let's uh, see what we could do. I mean, look at our strength. Our relative strength is so huge. The Northern Empire is the next nation to fall. Kazate is massive. So is Valandia. <clears throat> Which is kind of a double-edged sword. It's going to make owning our own kingdom pretty not easy. <laughs> well, did I not? Did I not save this? Another example of why I am not a smart man. Uh, there's one Hastati. Well, might as well put the other one up there with him, so he's got a he's got a bro. So train warriors are fine. These guys are fine at one. Basically, just spearmen. Um. The wood runners, though, we just got a grip of these. And I'm ready to kind of do this. This. Two and five. Two and five. We'll make an actual dedicated skirmisher unit. Now that we've got so many. <clears throat> Luna, thank you very much, and it absolutely does. I really appreciate that. Five dollar donation coming out from Lunith Fujisaki. Thank you very much. If you have any other questions, by all guys, by all means, guys, let me know. <laughs> cats. Live with cats and you start falling apart the seams. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna hero. I kind of want to take. I know we all like the bear helmet, but this is like my favorite Batanian helmet in the game. With a feather? I don't see a feather. Next to, uh, actually I think I like the hero one more. Where's the fiends? Uh, actually I really like this one. I like the heavily Roman one, but I've never seen this one in the game outside of all my characters. Yeah, the one that the champions got is one of my favorites. These guys are... I, I think it's supposed to be this helmet that she's got on. But yeah, I love this helmet. So I think I'm gonna... 
think I'm gonna go ahead and make a move. I know it's got a it's got a history. She can now inherit the bear helmet. My wife and I look like damn near the same. Isn't that it's so us? Ugh. It's so us, you know? She's so pretty. She's so pretty, even though she's got just gnarly braided hair. <laughs> Is Ironmonger cool? Still nothing cool here. I don't really like these pauldrons. I've not seen the rest of this, the, the chest piece of this armor though in the game. Exactly. See, exactly, Wolfguard. Uh, I, fashion, fashion in Banner Lord is really is a real thing, you know. Like, if you don't like the look of your character, what's the point? Guys, last night I I played like four hours of Stellaris. Gotta say, I really like that game. Oof, that's pretty up there, Ivan. <clears throat> I'm thinking of uh, doing another stream of... Darkest Dungeon, because I'll be playing Darkest Dungeon 2 on the channel when it comes out. we will be making guides, doing all sorts of fun stuff with that, but I have to wait until that uh, fortunate moment. I have all the DLCs. Uh, Paradox was nice enough to send me all the DLCs. But I don't really understand those DLCs yet, so I'm just playing a base game. I, I'm playing the Imperium of Man. I made my guide Imperium of Man. Prof, just turn on the tutorial. The tutorial helped me out a lot. And I just kind of like bang my way through it. It's not like Crusader Kings, dude. I'm like, I have no idea what the hell is going on in Crusader Kings. I'm always like, <sighs> sure, do do a do a thing. Want to cut a besiege? Ooh. PvP. I I did not try the new Butcher Circus or whatever the new one is. Is it fun? Oh, Zianica was taken. Whoo! Better Western Empire. Uh, probably pre-heresy Lunith. Still a mercenary. <laughs> Our merc I th I think we're not. No, we're a mercenary still. We're a mercenary still. I mean, you guys can tell me if you think we should jump over to a, a vassal, but the point of it, the point of this is to not be a vassal and uh, make our own kingdom, but getting a fief would be kind of nice. Yeah, when you start out, it, like a little, a little like voice should be like, do you want to use a tutorial, Master Bruce, Master Luke, Master Luke? Captain Price, or Captain, yeah, Captain Price, you can't yet that we know of. Amatatus is besieged by what, I wonder? Okay, stop it. By a paltry army, actually. Let's go bring the forces of good. I don't have enough, uh, what's it called, to buy a castle? Soldier! With me! Where'd they go? Infantry! Inf infantry! Stay close! Infantry! Soldier! Soldier! Infantry! <laughs> I don't even know what's going on. Move! Infantry! Move! Footman, hear me! Stand up, right? Infant, move, fall, footman! Soldiers! Footman, so soldiers! Footman! These look like friendly people that are not friendly.
Yes, my hill people charge. There's too many. There's three factions involved in this fight, and it's it's breaking my brain open. Oh no. Where the hell is the rest of our army? Our army, Jesus! The second time this has happened. Ugh. Look at all my guys dying. Yeah, that that's one swaggle. We'll retreat from that. That's that's a bunch of bullshit. I don't think I have anything close to that. Nope. We just lost, like, almost our entire army from that crap. That sucks. We had a really strong force going into it, and then just... Did you see that red, 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 red? Because <sighs> I thought I was moving with the army, but no. Man, we lost a lot. We lost a lot. With the Wild Men of Dunland? It's, it's fun, actually, man. I love it. Definitely advanced too far, but like I had no idea where the rest of the army was. So we'll jump back into it now. Infantry! Shields up, soldiers! Move out! Oh, Infantry! You're gonna go there. Get moving! Infantry! Arms like the pot! Soldiers! After me! Shocking! It plane. is shocking! Shocking! Oh well, the uh, the foxman there. <clears throat> Luna, did it, like, dude, it Buck totally man. was. Oh, My guy, like, the whole army just like advanced and then retreated back. Like, fuck this. Oh yeah. That's. Yeah, uh, I understand how you guys feel. It's pretty intense over here. Huh? Soldiers. I also was playing a lot of Hunt Show. Pone, have you played Hunt Showdown? Footman, soldiers. Um, Aerodom, it's kind of interesting to be honest. I kind of just forget about him. It's really fun. I was, I've been playing with Indy. Hey, got one. Got one. Yeah, I'm, I'm not moving. If, this, if these forces are here, psh. Dude, I agree, man. I'm like, makes me want to sit on my stoop and drink a beer and whittle a little wooden horse. Um, <clears throat> Indy and I are going to be making a video for Hunt Showdown. And by say Indy and I, I mean he's going to record it and put it on his channel. Uh, Ginobili, it's a really popular game. Ginobili Tromboli. Oh yeah, that's what, we're guys, that's what you guys are doing? You're just kind of randomly running? Yeah, fuck it. Screw the bridge. Infantry. Moonshine. Footman. Move out, soldiers. Forward. Soldiers. Footman. Infantry. Soldiers. Soldiers! Move out! A good commanding position. Footman! That, whoa. I have 125 archers.
Every shot of his shield. Yeah, but not you, dude. Damn it. Damn it. Stop it. Look at him. He's got these mad juking skills. Next level. Next goddamn level. What, what the fuck, man? Like, are you serious? Again they do this crap? No, no, what are you doing? Yeah, got him! I suppose you may advance. Oh man, that's a double Lord kill right there. The sniper from Batania. Sniper in the glades. I have no idea where my archers are. They're right there. Dude, I, I, I would love to be a barbarian prof. Like last time, dude, they just... The whole force abandoned me. I'm sitting there alone. I'm like, oh, no. And I just watched my whole army get machine gunned apart. Oh! Oops. Run through the gully here. Got him. Oh. Victory at the cost of like 40 of my top tier troops. <laughs> Get these bullshit looters out. We had so many more Oathsworn and uh, Pickled Warriors a second ago. Damn shame. Where are our clan? We've got 10 of those left, which is. Get rid of some of these heaps. Kettle? Don't have these prayers on their own. I don't want to do that quite. Do a little arena. Who wants, to, who wants to see a little arena? I want to see a little arena. I, will, dude, I was watching like a watching chat that was not updated. <sighs> you can make a kingdom without the main, main quest now. Yes. Oh, this is not gonna be fun. Oh, oh, my horse.
Oh! Blood Green, what's up, man? No. That's gonna hurt. That was brutal. Alright, so who else is on my... Oh, there's Nether the Bull here? Get Nether the Bull. Nailed it. How long have I been streaming? Uh, about like a, a less than an hour, Lund Green. Why am I on a horse so much? Wow, that was awesome. Ooh, even better. That's my guy. Got wild Fenton over there. Uh, if you type in exclamation point uptime, it should work. Check it. Check to see if it works. Oh, what a block, Fenton! Skirmisher in me, huh? But I'll do this. Then I'll chop. Then I'll chop again. Then I'll sweep. Oh. Did it, Wolfgar, did it tell you the uptime? Did it like whisper it to you or something? Hey, we got a donation. Imperial Spear is, out, uh, is countable, yes. Lund Green, $25 donation. Holy shit, man. Doing well lately. Want to share the wealth. Well, thank you very much, dude. Hey, Lund Green, did you see the new donation page? Is it, does it look cool? Like, I, does it work well, too? <laughs> Want to make sure it actually like looks... Uh, I'm using uh, Stream Elements versus Stream Labs now. And there's just a couple features that I liked about it. Uh, Steven Carpenter was saying that uh, it, it's really easy to get, like, signed up for... Uh, Streamlabs Pro inadvertently, and I don't like that, so I don't want you guys to get, like, wrapped into some sort of bullshit service. And he said it's really hard to, uh... Oh, man, this guy's just armored to the teeth! Was this, an Oath Sworn? Of course it is. Oh! I hope so, Melody Maker. I hope so. Uh oh, Jessica's here. Jessica's here, guys. No one make a move. I can't stab this guy in the face. He's so deadly. I hit him, and then I hit his shield. He's got the most health in the world. Oh my god. His chamber in me left and right. Oh, thank god. Fuck. Uh, Randall, what do you mean today? Um, I'm in Pacific Daytime, so today for me is 11.30 a.m. And there was one 24 hours ago from around right now. Did you get one when you woke up? It'll, it'll help me determine if, if there was an actual patch today or not. Because I, I didn't wake up and see one.
Not a new one. Okay, I was like, I'm like starting to like check on like fucking. That was a huge hot fix. Wait for some time, get our health back, get our guys to recover a little bit, maybe get some people to convert. Dumb Dimmy, Dumb Diddy, what's up, man? Ooh, athletics. Hit points or movement speed? Let's go hit points. Hit points are so crucial since we're on foot. Steward. Steward. So here's what I've kind of noticed on all my playthroughs. I don't have a ton of characters above level 14. Because I'm now getting to a point where I need to get skill points in things that I don't primarily get skill points in. We need party size. I'm good, Awarsu. How are you? They fixed the wars in a big way. It's so much nicer now. I mean, diplomacy is still a little shit with this, but it's because we are have, like, we're so much stronger than the Northern and the Western Empire. And maybe I should just join them as a vassal. Because I want to get a thief. ASAP. Do you guys have any opinions? Because we get that thief and we will basically make a kingdom from it. Uh, Anwar, that tells us who's at war with who. Take a look. So this tells me that the Northern Empire is at war with the Hidden Hand. Northern Ember, or uh, Embers of the Flame, Eleftheroi, and Vlandia. And if I click over here in, in Kazate, I can see they're at war with the Western Empire and Karagir. Uh Sturgia is at war with the Western Empire and the Lake Rats. So it's it's awesome. Yeah, I know, Ivan. That's why I was like, oh, I'll go for this one. Hey, dude. All good here. Hope you're well and keeping safe at this crazy time. I am Dumb Diddy, and thank you very much for your donation, man. Thank you very, very much. Uh, you can prof, but I've also noticed that like, if you do it, it just you just leave the the kingdom and that like, you can leave the kingdom, and take the fief that you took, or that you've been granted, and they'll be pissed off at you. You can leave the kingdom and leave the fief, and they won't mind, and then create your kingdom. I mean, if anything, I should probably vassal like a really weak nation. That way, when they when when I away from them it doesn't matter like go become a, um, a southern empire vassal and get a fief and then as soon as they start to kind of fall in, in popularity as soon as I get as soon as I get that fief just make my own kingdom Any mod? Any mods I'm excited for? Um, a Warhammer mod's gonna be really sick. Horseman. Oh, nice little. Let me organize this. I, I keep looking at this, going like, "Where the hell's where's what?" That goes there. Um, in my. Um, in my next campaign, I've been talking to Surreal Beliefs, and he kind of gave me the lowdown on what he uses for his campaigns, keeping them pretty succinct and fun with mods. So my next campaign will be a very modified campaign. Like, really, really modified. Wolfguard, good call, man. That's a good call.
Lord of the Rings mod, definitely gonna happen there. I, I, that's gonna be sick. Tale is old as time. He and the beast. Uh, they don't have them yet, Prof. I hope I wish they did. Oh, uh, yeah. How much just chaff shit infantry do I have? I could make some more volunteers. I could make these guys, like... I would like to kind of spend some time real quick again. Now that the looter groups are super thick, let's do this. Upgrade my archers? Well, I guess it's a good point. When it comes to... I like to upgrade my archer... I like to upgrade things in batch. But um, with archers, I don't really see that as big of a crucial issue because it's so easy for them to get experience by just range damage. So... That's a good point. Good call on that, Johnny Smith. You get a cookie. Nice. Makova... Oh, Castle was taken. Uh, it was released after the battle. Oh! Those parties were in. I assume we took Malkova Castle, right? I'm gonna resolve Senate decision. I can't! I'm fucking mercy. Oh, just the whole thing. The whole thing. Yeah, it would have to be like, if it was Warhammer, it'd have to be Warhammer, not like old worlds, or not, not like um, magic related stuff, you know? I fight not with ye, brigand. That's alright, Wolfgard. I'll, I'll allow it, dude. Men. Okay, six. Infantry! Just get my army out kind of lined up here, take a look at everything. Forward. My elite troops, quote unquote elite. Look at you guys. Remember there was like millions of you? Now look at you, you ragtag sons of bitches. Infantry, infantry, get moving. Footman, soldier. Uh, you can go support them. Oh, look at that! Headshot, headshot. We lost a volunteer. That's fine. Plus six guys by some. Oh, we got one killed, five wounded. We'll take it. Eight levels. But we do it. That's why we do it. Jonah, what's up, dude? Soldiers! Footmen, move forth! Soldier, hold arrows! I love that. Hold arrows and they all pull out these gigantic two-handed swords. With the Fiend Champion. Eh, nothing cool on that one, so that would be a little stick looking. Nice. That's right, run you Ponty hairdressers. Oh! Dear Tay. I'm still good, man. I'm still good. Man. Hey, Pone. You want to do uh, some... What's it called soon? 
uh, some ca some captain ship with a uh, turn. Maybe this weekend or something. Do I know when they'll start the Sturgia playthrough? Um, I'll start the Sturgia playthrough once I'm done with my Valandia playthrough. Ooh, look at this. Dude, just, do you hear that, like, non-stop people have been giving castles and shit? Like, so many, like, factions are being shut down right now. What is this? God, I play so much Sea of Thieves and it's got a Sea of Thieves thing. All of you! Stop shooting! Soldiers! Six. Advance! Advance! Uh, Danilla, that, that might be the one from yesterday. You know, this thing will actually like level up your uh, your bow more because you're running and you're getting momentum. It's a harder shot. Oof! We lost three. Yeah, the the thread and they Randall they used to put it at the front. They used to just edit the the parent one, which I don't understand why they don't anymore. Lundgreen, I agree, dude. I really want to get a better sword. I should just about be eight and In fact, actually if I do this. There. That whole group will now level up way faster. Cause there's not and the, the, so you're probably wondering why they're going to level up faster. Uh, <clears throat> think of it this way. Rather than there being... Hold! Soldier! Footman, hear me! Yeah, we're going to head over to craft. Dude, Matt, look at, look at Matt Ross. He's like, oh, crafting time? I'm here. <laughs> Onward, footman! And I'll just have you guys... Caramel! Face up! Hey, whoa, what's with the rapid fire rocks here, man? Okay, you sons of bitches. Fine, fuck you guys. Couldn't get any hits off. I'm getting blocked. Oh. Time to do some crafting. 153, you bros checking in today. Make sure you guys are liking the stream. I've noticed none of the timers are going off. I haven't seen a single timer. Oh yeah, look at those sweet highborns. Y'all know I love them highborns. So, uh, you you might have noticed that I actually have a shit ton of skirmishers. So let's watch this. Uh, Shazab, I agree with you. I've always been a huge fan of uh. Inf soldiers, footmen, infantry, arrows. I've always been a real fan of like arrows where it's like. Tss, tss, tss. It's just that, that quick, like, elf-like firing that you get from like, Lord of the Rings. But I have them all, like, on, on F4, so they're running back and shooting, running back and shooting, running back and shooting. They're, they're missing. They're very much missing. Soldiers! Get 
but they'll be a really devastating force once they can uh, get all the wildlings. So let's go over to... Oh, we're right here. Let's go to Pencanic. Anything new happen? Amitatus, Bionica, Diathma. That was kind of near the beginning. Dengle the Outcast. What are you? Nothing cool. These prisoners. What are these guys? Body up. They do drop like flies, Melody. That's why I have them in their own group. Oh, Highland Fur Boots, you say? You guys know how much I enjoy a good arena. Oh, this is just going to be a two-handed sword fight. Come on, Fenton. With your 240 two-handed sword, come at me, bro. Didn't expect to follow through, did you? Oh, crap. Got him. Been tawned. Uh, no, in fact, if you start your own kingdom later, it's typically like the game kind of prefers it. Oh man, I'm getting chambering down. So with, a, with like either a one-handed weapon <clears throat> or a two-handed weapon, if you time the attack, it chambers. Ooh, uh, one sec, come on, let me read that in just a second here. Oh Christ. Oh. Yeah, right, right, yeah, huh? Victory. All right, let's see if I can, let me see if I can duplicate this. Where's he going? Okay. Oh, he juked me. Yeah, see, if you time it right, he, he'll chamber that immediately. That's sick. I finally get to see Bannerlord. I finally get to see Bannerlord. Quick question about Gotrek and Felix when they fight that crazy beast at Karakate Peaks. Is that a chaos troll? Oh, man. Um, <clears throat> Como, I haven't read Troll Slayer. Uh, do they go to Karagay because of Control Slayer? I read those books when they came out. In 2000 and some. So, let me take a look. Go Trek, Felix. Because I do not remember. If Sotek was here, he would know for sure. Because he's read them again recently. Even Turn would know. Turn just reading them right now. Um... It is Troll Slayer that they go to Karakate Peaks. And I think it is a Chaos Troll then. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. However, before he can claim it, a huge creature bursts out and kills him, tearing his head off from his shoulders. The creature is a great troll. Hinted and corrupted by Warp Stone, twisted and mutated by the power of Chaos that it has been... That it has, that it has become strong, something far more terrible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely a chaos troll, my dude. And thank you very much for the donation, my, my friend. Okay. Let us go to the trade window. Anything fun here? Nothing fun here. Anything fun to sell? Everything fun to sell. Excuse me. Enter the smithy. 
All right, any cool two-handed weapons? I want the mountain blade. Yeah, it was actually a pretty good one. It was just it was just simply um, two-handed weapon fighting. Battle blade. The war razor is, I think, the Tanian. Spatha, War Sword. I want the Mountain Blade. Guys, how do we get the fucking mount? You cannot craft bows. There is no fletching in this game. Although, I guess, is fletching still considered making bows? I thought fletching was just simply to, I mean, to fletch is to make an arrow. Correct? Chris, where's crisps when you need them? You know what? I like, did I, I answered your question, right? I want to make sure I didn't ignore that. So is this game 4x but heavy on RPG elements? I'd say it's uh, I'd say it's RPG with with light 4x elements more or less, uh, but it's not a 4x in the sense that there's a victory condition because it's kind of just an open sandbox game. It's new. One you can bowery. Oh yeah, because there's a boyer. A bowyer. I'm glad you liked it, Timu. Like I say, like I always say, if there's a chance for me to dress up like a big idiot, I'm all about it. Like, when we went to Horsham uh, for the Ever Chosen for the, for the Vampire Coast, and they are like, well, we've got this crab costume. And the way they kind of approached it was kind of timid, like, we don't know who's going to wear this. And I was like, yeah, absolutely, I'm down. And Joey, the the um, branding, she's in branding um, and marketing, he was like, oh, oh uh, really? I'm like, yeah, yes, absolutely. Fucking done. So done. Let me have that damn costume, lady. She's also like the sweetest person in the world. Joey is a mom of two kids. One kid. But she's just like very motherly. Why did I put this on? I guess we'll go with the broad two-hander and make this weapon. And though, I want that. Matt Ross, how dare you? How dare you insist that I would want a shield? Although I do have a... Uh, because you can't make one-handed, two-handed uh, swords from the one-handed... Or from the two-handed menu. It's got to be in the one-handed menu, correct? And is it the grip or the blade that does that? Sorry. Bailey was in antsies and antsies. Oof. Six swords. <laughs> hey, Ryan Clark, how are you doing, dude? It is possible to make a couch lance, yes. I don't think I have any cool batanian blades here, unfortunately. Yeah, you know, I can't I can't unlock the batanian blades to save my goddamn soul. It's a bunch of horse shit. <sighs> yeah, I know I know the, the grips are in the menu. 
I'm just kind of looking at them. Oh, I'm down on the bed. He's like, you should, you should wash these sheets. If I've been up on here, rolling my butt around because I'm a crazy golden retriever. Oh, look at that. Ooh, Highland Decorated Blade. What does it look like? Oh, it looks so sick. That's the one. That's the one. That's the one. But I need to unlock it. <laughs> oh, how do I unlock it? Matt Ross, tell me how I unlock it. Look at that thing. Like, it's so beastly looking. I've had one of those before. It's a decorated blade. That's got a, that's got a really nice reach and cut damage to be honest. So looking for a grip. Uh Yeah, but you can't make two hand you cannot make two-handed or you can't make one-handed swords that can also be two-handed. Unless you're in the one-handed menu, right? Oh, that's a good point. Only has a swing. Oh, I thought they were on the one-handed menu. Oh, I see. I see it. Okay, okay. Oh. These are my grips. Did you not? Could you not drink your kuka on my bed, please? Just... And then when I tell her to stop, she looks at me like... Why? Oh, Dad? You said I told you to stop? Don't drink your butt on my bed. Have some decency. You raised by wolves? Raised by wolves. You raised by wolves. Um, I might have to make another. Uh, that. Oh, good girl. I have only begun. Anonymous donated ten dollars. Just got home from work in time to catch up the very end of the stream this time. <laughs> well, thank you very much for the donation, man. I really appreciate it, brother. Yeah, we'll be streaming for a little bit. I think we're only like I said, forty-five minutes into this, so we've got like four hours. Very late. All right, club. We're just going to forge this. To, oh, we need ourselves some wood. Uh, we're going to forge it just to get some parts, and I'm not going to sell it. I'm just going to break it down again. Do you still do marketing, or is it all your marketing? What do you mean by that, Lundgren? Um, So I was... <clears throat> I uh, have 10 years' experience as a... Sales manager, but I also did internet marketing. Whilst doing 
Same. Wait, wait, wait. Hardwood. Did I buy all the hardwood? Puppy. Oh, I am. That deal. I am a full-time YouTuber now, Glenn Green, yes. Uh, you can't increase your map speed? Uh, that is because you probably have a high amount of herd, uh, which means you might have a lot of uh, pack animals and not speed-based animals. Uh, make sure you're getting the horses that have the speed icon and not the pack icon. Read the difference. Um, Aerodom, yes, you can make super strong weapons. Callus pommel, bombed. Eastern heavy mace. Yep, Thalia, that is absolutely why I've done that. So basically, you want the amount of horses you have to match the amount of. Um, um, what's your, what to call it? God. Uh, tr su uh, soldiers you have got. Ooh, we got a donation. Sorry, man. Callahan, tip $5. Also, follow up tip because puppy forgot to sign previous tip. New donation link. Who dis? Yeah, man. I, I switched over to Stream Elements because I heard that Streamlabs was making it so people would automatically sign up for their pro account stuff, and I didn't want that for you guys. So I don't know if it's still a thing or if it's happening with a lot of people, but uh, it, it seems to be working out a lot better. Um, I don't know how to... Ahmed, are you still here? Ahmed al Sahil, <clears throat> al Sahil, sa li Jeez. I'm telling you, it'll work at all. Oh, what? <laughs> What's this? What is this? What is this? Does this just keep petting you? The Earl of Pupsville indeed. Okay, Ahmed, let me show you uh, what I meant earlier. So there's these two icons. If you look at here, the Britannian Pony, used for increasing speed versus the Mule, used for carrying goods. 
So if you see this icon and you've got too many of these horses, it'll sometimes create herd. Also, if you've got too many hogs and cows, it will create herd. So if I were to say, oh, there's not enough horses here for me to just buy a, buy a load and show you. Elec, yeah, uh, make uh, ironmongers will produce more uh, armor. You, what are you doing? What are you doing? Um, but you want the you want those to kind of uh, hey, what's up, Steven? Your base is only three point five, so you might need to just buy more of those the horses with speed on them, and that should help you out. What's up, Markowski? Uh, Aerodom, I grew, I grew up in the 90s learning how to type, so I have that that heavy that heavy thumb slap. My my typing teacher when I was in elementary school was like, "Don't type like that. It's too hard. It's too heavy." I'm like, "I'll type how I want." on but here for a little time we put our uh, endurance up health what I've been petting you so much what I'm gonna get in a fight soon and then I can't pet you gonna make a couple more of these and I'm just doing it to get uh, better items unlocked so that we can make make the sword absolutely not a problem Ahmed Rough leather, two handed grip, falchion blade, mm -hmm. grip, oval, bamboo shaft. Uh, I don't know. Are, are javelins better for unlocking stuff? Because remember, we're not going to sell any of this. Oh yeah, we unlocked the the Menavlian head. What's up, Zodi? Good lord, animal. Thanks for the stream. Goodbye. Do you play historical miniature war games? Paris, thank you very much, man. I don't, but I heard of a game called Saga, and I heard Saga's really cool. If what goes over 100? You're pushing against me. Oh, okay, so let's mess with the sliders then. One. 
Which kind of damage, though? Are you you're talking about uh, thrust or oh? Well, it's over one hundred. Yeah, let's try this. It's over one hundred. Wow. Oh, on the javelin. Let's try that. Let's try some javy poos. Dumb diddy dumb, that's really weird, man. You guys can hear me okay, right? I moved the mic so you can see Bailey. Hey, Elliot. Poncho, what's up, dude? Fantastic job with the ever chosen. Keep up the badass work. Absolutely, man. Thank you very much for the donation, brother. Dude, KFC, I could, I could eat a whole bucket right now. Oh, uh, wrong guy. Ooh, look at all those. Damn, oh, this is the, oh, javelin head. Got the javelin head. He's like pushing against me wildly. So, the reason I jump back out is because we got the javelin head, so that when we go to do this, javelin, and I go here. Oh, we want the harpoon head, that's what we want. Uh, you wanted to see the price though? There you go. 108,000. Which is nice because I can make a ton of these things real cheap and easy. So if I go back to that. <clears throat> Wanna go get him? One sec, guys. Go. Oh, my non-smith commands to grab. Uh, why is that, Matt? Don't I want to use the guy who is uh, um, who has the trait that has me unlock more when crafting? Don't I want to use him for that?
We need to go get some more hardwood. Oh, we should pop over here with that Glanis. Dude, Poncho, this is the tank type you can buy in the, uh... You can buy this one in... On the channel. You can get it as a sticker, as a poster, as like a tote bag, as a bunch of different things. Here. Here you go. You may now, it should, it should pop up here. I'll, I'll even put the actual... Boom. Pin. There you go. It's now, I actually just reduced the price on everything. So I was looking at the price that it like auto sets and I'm like, nah, it's a little high. So you can now get somewhat cheaper prices and everything. And if you use the uh, code stream at checkout, it's like a 10 or 15% discount, I believe. It looks like the prices haven't updated, but it, it will when you jump into the marketplace itself. Okay. Yeah, man. Um, I'm having the same person who made the shirts, or who made the, the art. She's, I commissioned her to make some, or I'm going to commission her to make some. Buy it all, fuck it. Um, emojis, emojis. Matt Fazio, you know, bro. Sun's out, guns out, man. Let's jump over back to here. Me with hair? I, think I've, I don't think I've had hair in eight years, man. Geek Nerd, what's up, dude? There will not be a giveaway, but Thunder Dirt, I'll probably do one uh, next or this weekend. But because uh, Stephen uh, Lee donated $50 for a, uh, a giveaway, and I had to get my keys reset on Fanatical so I can do another one for you guys. Uh, Aerodom, it's just, they were supposed to be one this week, and we're on Thursday right now, so it's kind of like a hope. Mmm. Oh, I see what you mean, Scott. Yeah, uh, Xenos, I beta tested it, and then I got the collector's edition of it. I played it when it first came out, and then I stopped playing when, <laughs> uh... Dude, Matt Fazio, I want G Fuel to sponsor me. I don't know if I have my G Fuel. I mean, I've kind of switched over to Sneak, to be totally honest. But if so, if either one wants to fucking sponsor me, whoo! I'm all about it. Yeah, guys, do make sure you say thank you if you see Stephen Lee in chat, Richard Fry, Stephen Carpenter. They've donated over a thousand dollars in keys to you guys, as well as a number of other individuals who have said, hey. Here's my $50 contribution to more keys and so on and so forth. So we have definitely had a lot of people donating more keys to the channel. So it's not me buying them. It is all them. Okay, what was I doing? Smithy. Dragon Overlord, what's up, dude? How are you? <clears throat> Sorry guys, my brother's texting me. I'm just making sure everything's okay. <sighs> Back on Overlord. Even though this is my job, I still sometimes wake up and don't want to work, so I understand. Okay, so let's make some of these javelins. I'm just trying to knock out real quick here. I know it's kind of frustrating to watch, but we do this, we should... And should we... Ben Dan! Jesus Christ! Rapid fire these things. Pump them out. 
Wow, he ran out that fast. Well, I'll try. I'll try with this guy. Wow, that was fast. Aura, melt for me, lady. Dude, she got forty skill points from that. Oh my god, that is disgusting. She went from one skill point to 65. Well, efficient charcoal maker she is. And now a curious smelter. Maybe I'll have her mix steel, I don't know, but curious smelter it is, whatever. That was, that was stupid fast. You guys see that? It was ridiculous. Ask Mike VA. He is a voice actor. Yeah, Eridom, that's exactly what it's from. So let me look at Forge, two handed weapons. Nothing in the tier 5 category. You call Metaro. I want this bad boy. That was all tier six. Well, Ufgard, that makes two of us, because I will eventually join the gaming industry in time. Okay, uh, any good two-handers? Look at that one. This one. Path the Blade. I mean, we're still not getting any, like, of the nicer tier 5. Like, I just want that. We've got some nice two-handed uh, axes, though. Oh, that's okay. I meant like in it, in it, Connor. I want to go work at a company. So this is actually kind of a better weapon, obviously, because it's got Thamaskeen. So maybe we just go with this. It'll look very cool. <laughs> well, the two-handed weapons in general don't look awesome. The one-handers just look sweet. Like, I mean, come on. Decorated blades and shit, like... It's so weird you can give this thing, these things two-handed axes, two-handed weapons. I'm sorry, two-handed blades, two-handed grips, or a bastard sword grip, which is a hand and a half. Um, we can make that machine, though, Border Collie. I can just refine it with this uh, uh, Fenton. Refine into fine steel. Yeah, fine, refine into fine steel and refine into uh, the other one, but... Um, uh, Aerodom, you can in the two-handed menu, but not in the one-handed menu. <clears throat> oh, so Matt Ross, you use a smithing mod that allows me to add that? That's pretty cool. I will probably do that. <laughs> so does it mean that you can then make a two-handed sword from the one-handed menu that is a two-handed sword? And Stephen Bippus, uh... I was the head of an enterprise, like corporate enterprise sales, and 
I was making like, I don't know, a hundred and I think I looked at my last taxes, $122,000. And I quit that to do this. And it, it is vastly lower in income, but I couldn't be happier by comparison. I was miserable every day. But I agree with you. Like I, I can do this because I'm single. I have got no kids. I don't have a house. So I've got no real uh, monetary obligation outside of a car, uh, not a car loan, a car, um, yeah, a car loan. So I don't have any big, heavy things. I'm very privileged in that sense. But if I had a, like, I can't keep doing this to support a family unless I get huge. But yeah, it's, it's not something that is like a very, it's a, what it was meant to do was build a resume for me. And it ended up becoming something that I love doing. Yes, Aradam. Correct. Oh, ho, ho. Matt, can you send me that, that mod? Dude, I, to support a family, I would probably have to get Kings and Generals huge. Well, maybe not really Kings and Generals. I just couldn't, if I wanted to support a family, I could be Turin big, but I, I just wouldn't be able to live in Southern California. It, I mean, Turin and I spend so much money on rent and mortgage, it's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Um, if I was as big as Pixelated Apollo or um, Car uh, Heir of Carthage, I mean, Heir of Carthage is married. He's got a, he's got kids, but he also is he has a full time job uh, as a district manager. The K and G, I love Kings and Generals. He pops in every so often. He says hi. He used to be a Total War YouTube, uh, YouTuber. Um, I'm gonna just kind of put a pause on that for a sec. Hey, okay, why is it going? Monica Castle started. Thinking, destroying my life. Yeah, that's true. He's, he needs those robot hands fast. We've got Zionica, we got Amatatus, got Rotai, Athma. Are we pushing in? Where am I? Fuck am I? Oh, I would if even if I got a job, I'd still do it on the side. I would not stop doing this. I just wouldn't do it full time. All right, I'll, I'll be here. I ain't going no place nowhere. Let's go do this. Recruit some troops. Ooh, we'll get that. I'll just get that. I'll get that. Go down. Kind of get involved in some fights a little bit. It'll it'll weaken our army a little bit, which is nice. We'll come back and do the same thing. But Matt, if you want to send me that uh, <clears throat> that mod again, I'll download it and queue it up, and then I'll quickly shut the game off and turn the mod on. Like, well, I don't. I'll, I'll give it a shot. Fuck it. <laughs> This is all supposed to be kind of an experimental uh, thing anyway. Hey, look at this. Looks like a little bit of value. Infantry! Six. Man, move forth! Soldier, soldier. Here. We'll advance together as a cohesive unit and team. Footman, move out! Onward, soldiers! Lower arrows! Maybe, maybe not so... A, co a cohesive unit here. Ow! Sickle away from me! Russia? Christ, Breton. I don't even know where that arrow went. I want to get another siege going. Are they going to be Iron Hands? Uh, what do you mean? 
Oh, I get what you're saying. I, the turn comment, yeah. In a city ruled by crime. We're at war with who? Make peace with the Northern Empire. I can't. I am no one of import. Just beating everything apart. Does the Southern Empire even own anything anymore? Uh, they own Ortizia. You, uh, this is with the Northern Empire. That'll probably go through. Um, so Southern Empire and Western Empire is what we're doing. Here, I'll do this to resolve it. Doesn't matter to me. So they stand at war. You guys got 174 you bros checking in here today with a nice 97 likes. As always, guys, please do make sure you're liking the stream. Oh, God, I hate what happens. Sometimes my, my chat just stops. Um, let me push that real quick. Um, Dragon Overlord, I cannot play a song for you. Because if I do, it'll demonetize my stream. I see it and I'll listen to it later. Weapon part workshop. Download. Full WinRAR, huh? Okay, so we'll, we'll pop in these two mods and make ourselves a pretty sweet weapon once we deal with the next uh, situation over here. Yeah, the Force Bandits are like fucking vicious, dude. Yeah, where is everything? Army is traveling to Dunglanus, to Zionica to defend, Zionica to defend. Let's go to Zionica then. Darn in with your sweet voice. Are you tricking me? Well, half of them are ready to go to train warriors, so we'll do that. And then we'll take the rest of them and put them back into one. Same thing with these guys. Now we have a grip of trained warriors, which is really nice. These guys are much better. And now we'll fight this fight. I'm gonna get a little, little, little battle going. Yield! What's KCD? Football words! Footmen! So soldiers! Footmen! Soldiers! Oil! Footmen! Move! Infantry! Get moving! Infantry! Spread infantry! Raise your shit! Footmen! I have not played Kingdom Come Deliverance. I've heard it's great, though. I have nothing wrong with it. Or, no problem with it at all. I just not, not touched it. That's fair. Five. Holy shit. Okay, alright. Back up, back up. I'm sorry. Okay. 
Infantry! Infantry! Forward! Move! What man? Move! Soldiers! Soldiers! Move out! Forward! Get moving! Infantry! Move forward! Infantry! Infantry! What man? Face up! What man? Onward! I took that I took that blow for you. There are a lot of skill games going on. We lost Hastati and an Elf Swarm. Oh, what the hell was that? No, no delegation going, Aerodom. Uh, I lost some clan warriors. I lost some train warriors. It's unfortunate, but no. Yeah, most part, I don't mind. I'll take that. Sixty-nine. <laughs> nice. Oh, Wilbur. Hmm. Hmm. Did we join this army? Come on. Go oh, push into him. Come on. All right, well. There we go. That's what I wanted to happen. Wait. No, it's not. I was trying to push everyone into that fight with me. Ugh. Bastards. Push it, just push it, push it. Oh, just push in. You guys are, you guys are, you guys so outnumber them. Oh, there it is. Hmm. Weird. I find my own entire army has no motivation to join in. Bullshit is what that is. Bowman! I punch! My two archers over there. This is a massive field battle. Like, look at this. It's just, it's just two 
infantry forces smashing into each other. Infantry moving! Holy shit. Can I snipe someone out here? No, 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 no. Make a shield wall. Soldier. Oh, no. <laughs> Uh, Lunath, I think I'm at uh, around uh, 800. Oh, got him! Sounds like a little tap. Got him. Hey, get the hell away from me. Oh, I saw that. Okay, all right, backing it up, backing it up. Where's my thing of man? I'm good, Hugh. How are you doing, dude? Got him. Oh man! That, oh, I just fuck yeah! Fuck yeah! <laughs> oh, that wasn't the same guy. Whoopsies. Well, that guy just got torn down. All right, now you can charge in. Now you can charge in. Celebration! It's a celebration! So, my guys, I lost a single Batanian hero, which is unfortunate, but I could have gone so much worse. And you got two, two charm points for that, which is nice. And I get some more prisoners. A lovely treat, I'd say. Hey, hey! Don't scratch that hot spot. She got a little hot spot on her cheek. She keeps trying to like sneakily scratch. And she just like really does it stealthy. She's like <gasps> Hey, Drolgo, welcome to the channel, man. As a member.
And you can, if you want, sign up to be a member of the channel. That gets you the really cool little Space Marine helmet next to your name. And I'm working on a whole suite of new sweet emojis that are coming here. So it'll be really fun as soon as I get those added in. Donate some prisoners. Everything except for the tree REI. Take that, Vorthurt, son of Durthurt. And almost nothing. Our mercenary contract is just really not worth it. <laughs> Buy Among Us, company in trouble. Trouble. I would love that, Aerodom. I would love that. I mean, I can do that in this. Horse, ar horse archers are definitely countered by foot archers, like hard. Got it. Play. Anything cool? Show mail vest. Okay. So give me one sec, guys. Um, be here for just a second. Cool. Dude, people got so many levels in that last fight. Uh, definitely renowned for more battles. Smith, all the hills. That's good. Still a mark. I'm thinking of making a vas going into vassalage, but I don't want to lose. Um, I don't want to have to go to war with Batania. Okay, so let's jump. Uh, hold on. Yes, that's what you can do. Soldiers! Footmen, onward! Uh, Justin, I believe that's that's kind of they're working through all the uh, perks to fix them all. One-handed and two-handed were first. I think the next one will probably be pole arm and then archery. Okay, god damn it. Why me? Arjan. Do something. I thought they wouldn't get that close to, to... I thought they'd get some distance to start shooting. Lost five guys because of that horn swag glitch with the, with the woodrunners. Like, that was shit. That was not what was supposed to happen. <laughs> Put them all to skirmisher. Because they the armor upgrease is so much better. Okay, perfect. So let me do this. Save it. Pop open the game. 
Hey, Cincinnati, what's up, dude? Spoils of victory, dig watching this stuff, bro. Stay classy, stay hydrated. You too, man, good to see you, man. I haven't seen you a long time. How you been, you all right? Oh, will never fall. I think that's a, I think there's a leaderboard now when you donate and it tells you who's, if you donate through the, uh, the new stream elements thing, it shows you who's got the most right now, I think. Like who the highest donation is, I think. That takes the cake for today. Oh, no, Lundgren donated 25. That, I was going to say Cincinnati is our, is our leader, but Lundgren is just edging $5 over it. Let me, let me bring this up. Let me do improved smithing. Go to, go to this. Uh, local files, property. Local files, browse local files. Here, I'll show this to you guys in case you want to see. So in case you're having trouble setting up your mods, this is how you do it. Drag the whole folder into here. It'll extract itself, but we have to go into this and look for any .dll files, if there are any. There we go. Oh, that's an XML document. Bin to bin. Properties on these. And unblock it. Okay. Properties. Unblock it. That's just improved smithing. All right, easy enough. Oh, really? Well, yeah, I'll, I'll probably do that then. All right, so let's save again. And we're going to jump, jump out. We have, let me save this as also the Steam. Now we'll jump back into Stream Smith to do our smithing to see if it messes it up because uh, we can't ex we can't take those mods off the game once they're loaded into the game. So we'll see what happens here. Yeah, it works. Um, I'll use the Vortex app now, but I've never used it. Hmm. Would you say Cincinnati? Uh, hoping to get the code so I can reload for fourteen days. No luck so far. Oh shit! I'm sorry, man. The XML doc in the folder with the DLLs if you want to. What would I want to... Is there things I should be customizing, Matt? Odds. Weapon part workshop. Group smithing. Play! Right? This is, this is all copacetic. Crashed. Downloads. Where is the new? I just downloaded the newest. Charles. I, I don't know. I'm going to be totally honest with you. I don't know. I'm just going to kind of wing it. <laughs> it, it happens because I'm using reshade. And sometimes uh, if I don't press play immediately, it does that. Okay, so Stream Smith. Not to be confused with Will Smith. The real Bobby Bronco. Uh, final release date is supposed to be like almost a year from now. Let's jump into some smithing. 
Smith and Wesson. Um, that will be enabled when I do my uh, Kiss Up playthrough. <clears throat> okay, so what is here? What, what, how do I... Ooh! There it is! They're all there. So, the Highland Decorated Blade is right there in the two-handed weapon slot. I can just pop over on some of these items. I don't have it yet, though. Um, I don't really know what all this did, <clears throat> to be honest, Matt. <laughs> if there's anything you want to, like, kind of tell me. That is sick. That is so sick. Yeah, Dipl Batanian Diplomacy is going to be the name of it, Luna. Yeah, it was so crap. It had to be named Foible. Northern Long Hourglass Grip? Is that really an hourglass? No. That is so awesome. Deal 200 weapon or sword or grip. What does this do? Length? Weight. That is sick. Okay, so we got that one. The horse head. No, we're not even on. Uh... <laughs> so cool. Ah, that's huge. The engraved back sword blade you chose has engraved. Uh, let, let me make one of these, and we'll, we'll check that out. Oh, I see. So I could do. Dude, holy shit. I can make that size thing even longer. Holy crap. Like, it's basically. That's crazy. So that would make the, 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 smith, the smithing requirement on that through the roof. But I could just put it like right there. And I can make like two of these? Forge. Crank it up again. Forge. Island Pommel. We'll make a Buster Scythe just for you, man. Pitchfork me, Daddy. I don't, Pavel. I wish I did, man. Melt it, my wife. Get 39 skill points.
That's insane. Okay. What up, John Hirsch? Okay, jump back here. No! Alright, so you want me to do throwing weapon, head, max size. Jumping back over to Fenton. Burning through them. Give me all the damn hardwood. You have a lot of hardwood? Give it all to me. Uh, Anwar, I'm not. I, I'm only. I'm gonna break them down. I promise. I promise. <laughs> Island Steel Blade. Boom. The white doesn't seem insane on these, but look at look at the price on all of them. It's so stupid. <laughs> all right. Perfect. Fenton, I want you to refine me some. Whoa, that's sick. Um, yeah, I, I didn't really want to, Matt. <laughs> I was like, uh, I already kind of feel a little shitty. <laughs> What's my skill tree? I shall show you. Pretty much the top end. Um, and Penta needs some focus points up in this piece. We're going to switch him to a one-handed weapon, too. Fenton. Gore child. Trusty gore child. I got off of him. One handed weapon time for you, Fenton. Get your skill up, dude. Yeah, and again, I'm just trying to make a really badass sword here. <laughs> and I think I think we've kind of got it. I think we're there. Decorated fucking saber blade. I thought we got the Highland one. That is sick. Look at that thing. The knightly arming sword.
I think actually we just got a Highland blade. Period. Yeah, I think so too. That decorated that decorated saber is is awesome. No idea. Yes, 100% Matt. <laughs> well, guys, we're about two and a half hours into this. I feel like I've done a lot of crafting. Do you want me to keep going with this? Or, I mean, are you guys having an, are you guys at least enjoying it? Whoa, never seen these. Look at that thing. This is going to be the sickest sword. <laughs> Lavish guard, little hook on it. You can get such, you can make such sick looking gu uh, guns. What? Yeah, these uh, non shootable guns. You can make such sick looking um, boards. Like, I really like that. I've never really gotten into this as much. Well, I mean, I don't want it to be boring for you guys. Okay, I'll keep I'll keep going. We'll keep going. Oof, look at that video. So ornamental. Oh man, Ben's in here, man. Ben, uh, my old, my old compatriot through many, through many battles. Bearded <laughs> axe. I also, I, I kind of want to make a, just a really sick axe too, like a, a sword and an axe on my back. Two hundred maces. Oh damn! So it puts all the, the one-handed maces into the two-handed mace section. Because this is the only two-handed thing, technically. That's sick. Touche, Ivan. Touche. Uh, auto or uh, auto Ben. I'm using a. I'm using a mod. One playthrough. I should just use daggers. 
disgusting word. Ooh, Thomas Keen Steel Leaf Shape Spearhead. Right? And that that'd be kind of fun though, right, Riley? <laughs> Jesus. He's insane. And Felisa Bait? Come on. That's that's Bush League right there. Hmm. This could. And Dan. Hey. Nine point four, nine point four. Good lord, look at the size of these things. <laughs> Dude, oh my god, it's like oh yeah, I'm just gonna carry this bag of spears. <laughs> Ready for battle, guys. Send me into the thick of it. <laughs> I'm, I'm good to go. I'm just going to be chucking these pull arms down range. I'll take the dragon spears in Game of Thrones. Sell spears to Lord. I know I can. I know I can do that. I'm stoked. Just stacked up right now. It's, it, it, you hear boss music because it's definitely something you would see in um, uh, that. What's that movie? What's that game called? Uh, Dark Souls. <laughs> That's a good point. I didn't see the weight. The weight is through the roof. Anyone here worth upgrading right now? No. Into a Falksman, though. What's up, Miss Fortune? How are you? Okay, so, um, no, nothing, dude. Getting, getting a little shafted. Punching the dick there. Dick pommel. Let's just let's just burn through eleven of these. Jack up everything on it. So this should
Oh my god, the, dude, the reach on this. The reach, look. This is it at max everything. Its weapon reach is 171. I mean, that's pretty insane. So, we'll need to make some more iron. Fine. Ah, of course. I'm good, K-Van. How are you doing, man? You okay? You, uh, okay, I'll make I'll make a I'll make all of them, and I'll save one, and we'll go throw it in battle. Oh, I just used the wrong guy for it. God damn it! Yeah, we kind of have to be careful when we're making the weapon we're going to keep, because I don't want it to be just disgustingly, like, stupid long. I want it to be kind of in line with what it's supposed to be. So we got to kind of... Rain it in! Hardened oaken throwing axe handle. Green leather grip. Eastern flat pommel. Horn leather. Grips. Pommels. Pommels. Grips. Pommels. 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 Grips. 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 Hey! Flat ridge spot the blade. Damn. Guard. Light club. Mock high rug blade. Mountain blade! Mmm! Yes! I'm... What was that last thing I did? Fine. Just one more. You too, Hugh. Thanks for jumping in, man. It is not decorated. You are right. But at least I can make one today, Ivan. That's the point. I wanted to make one today, at least. Okay, let's check. <laughs> Come here, looters. Bows down! Everyone, move out! Bow man! Foot man! Good lord, look at this thing. Look at that. Chuck, look at that. Thrust damage too, man. Look at that thrusting. Oh no, it's so, it's so heavy. No! It takes forever to swing, so they're like, they're, def they're defending against it. No! No! <laughs> they can block it so easily. Oh no! <laughs> Dude, imagine if I threw that at a horse. Imagine if I threw that at a horse. Oh man, that was too good. Dude, look at it on my look at it on the map. Like it looks like he just got like a whole bunch of like banner poles on his back. I wish to just give it to I give it to my whole entire crew and have him just chuck these massive spears. Oh, it's so funny. Like harpooning a whale.
Okay, so let's jump into this. Now we can finally do this. Uh, mobile longbow back. And we'll wait for some time. <laughs> the pillum was now uh, is now a throwing weapon, as I can, as you can clearly see. Okay, so let's do we'll do we'll do what we've got. So tier five, do the mountain blade, which is great. Nothing else decorated, and I'll work on that. I think. Did I? Dude, strutting with ballista ammo, just hawking them at people. Okay, Fenton. Let us make the hand sword too. Okay, so we'll do the mountain blade for now. For now, just for now. But I can give it a two-handed, one-handed, which is good because I want to. Uh, I want to be able to. Uh, practice one-handed sword. So funny. <laughs> Ooh, I need more Thamaskins. Fine steel. Yeah, again. Out of hardwood. Oh, that was so funny. It was ridiculous. Is that a steel steel? Bro. Iron too? Good lord. Ugh. Hey, T.G. Atkins. Welcome. Welcome to the board as a friend of mine. Touche, I, I can. Let me, let me make this, let me make the sword, roughly. And then we'll figure out what we need. So, we've got Mountain Blade. The Priest of the Guard. Any other cool ones, though? The knightly gold. We're not a knight, though, you know? Oh. Knightly hammer. Mm. I mean, the northern greatsword one is so sick looking. Or sword. I kind of like this one a lot. I mean, that's sick, but a little more Vlandia. Our, our focus right now. You know, Aradom, I think Patreon, um, you can split the difference and do two there, two here if you want. I, I don't, I don't really know. I think for, for YouTube, becoming a member here, I don't know what the cut is, to be totally honest with you. I really don't. And I know Patreon, I get like 96% of it, I think. Um, but I'm gonna, I might start... Here, real quick, just in chat, if you guys could let me know, this would actually be pretty huge. Um, yay, yes or no, to streaming on Twitch. I'm probably going to do some multicast, like multi multi streaming. Save room. What do you mean save room? Ooh, guard a lot. Only 
OnlyFans, dude. My OnlyFans would be lit. It'd just be me in a tank top lifting. Too many people on OnlyFans. Ivan says no. I mean, I'm not a huge fan of Twitch. It's got a middle finger on it. I'll probably start multi-streaming so you guys can find me on both. It depends on your on your level. Yeah, well, holy crap. We want about 114. Oh, 114 is a good reach. I think 114 is pretty safe reach, right guys? It does massively increase that though, you're right. I mean, I'll still be able to craft it. Oh, these give you hand armor? Dude, I didn't know that. A novel to guard. Which ones help out with Link? I like this one right here. Thick! Guess we could drop the grip a little bit now too then. That's a pretty nice grip. Very simple. Nice. It brings oh look at that. Look at that. Look at the ombre on that. <laughs> yeah, I mean I don't know anything about that. That's pretty new to me, Stephen Lee. Yeah, we'll try it. We'll try both and just kind of see where it goes. What's up, Tiago? Uh, you never miss a streaming man or uh, the uh, what's it called? The um, singing. I'm always singing, one way or another. <sighs> okay. Yeah, and dropping this down is helping me out a lot too. Looking at. No much pommel. That's a simple wheel pommel. Very nice. Island pommel. Boom. We're doing that for sure. We're doing that one. Look at that thing. It's beefy. So this should be okay. Fenton's wang ring. <laughs> We can craft this as is. Um, hey, Red Gun, uh, keep it to English, man. I do not know what you're saying, fortunately. So I cannot answer your questions. If you are asking any questions. There's. Look at the wing. Some. Thing. On the wing. I think this might be. I think that might be the blade. Or the grip, I mean. I'm liking it so far. I mean, look, look at it. this has this has like a, oh whoa, sick. What's one? Yeah, this one has like the interior for like the leather of a BMW. <laughs> I like that's very simple. Highland, Highlands in the name. And it's a two one-handed, perfect. I kind of like this. Very simple, very easy. 
Okay, so let me let me take a look here. Um, thank you very much, Wolfguard. Yeah, the the goal here is to is to really expand the channel this year, and we we have a lot of stuff planned. I'm gonna be doing um a, a lot of other games. I'm gonna be hitting the big games. I'm gonna be doing are Darkest Dungeon Two, which is gonna be so fun to stream. Um, we'll be doing Vampire Bloodlines Two, uh, and um, Baldur's Gate 3. And I've already talked to Paradox, so I'll be getting early access for Vampire Bloodlines. Okay, so let me... Let me get this down here. So we've got the Mountain Blade. We've got... Thick. Bronze War Sword. Highland Blade. Those last two are Highland. Okay, I got that. They're both Tier 3? Both Tier 3. Okay. I just need to compare it to my weapon because I don't want to like spend all this time and make a shit weapon by comparison. So Stormbound has got a speed 93, 118 cut. Thrust. I don't really care about thrust. And then length six or one 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 and handling. Thanks, Thun Green. I appreciate that, man. Yeah, I told Stephen Lee that I was doing Vampire, and he was licking his chops. He was stoked on it. As am I, man. Okay, so let's just get everything back on this. We had this. Island, fine leather. Okay. Oh, good point. But I mean, the weight should be shouldn't be too bad, Ben. Okay, so if I bring the reach up, my reach length right now one eleven. So let's try to match one eleven. Put it there. We'll put it there, and we'll we'll tweak it from there. Um, but our 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 cut damage. That damage is a little low. Because we're, we're comparing to 118 cr uh, cut. Uh, thrust pierce damage is like double almost. Handling is way better. And that's not even touching anything else. Let's go over here. That's That beats it there. Probably gonna affect the length. How we do down a little. It's so little. <laughs> that Madara, uh, Madara. Yeah, what was the swing? Oh yeah, the swing speed is almost 10 more. The pommel will kind of... Yeah, that's good. I'll make the cut a little bit more. I mean, I think that's pretty good. It, we're we're six less cut damage, but our reach is way further. Well, let me look. So our weapon reach is two more. Our speed is eight more. Our pierce damage is like almost double. Our cut damage is six less, and our handling is five more. 
and it's 15 above our normal smithing, so hopefully we won't swing anything too bad, too big. You guys have, should I change anything else on this? And I can switch it to one-handed and have it still have the same reach and just be disgusting. Okay, okay, okay. Right there, right there. Perfect. Oh, yeah. Awesome. Excellent. Uh, Cincinnati, how does anyone increase troop experience and progression? Uh, Raise the Meek, I think, was fixed. That one helps out a lot with tiers 1 through 3. Um, and I think it's probably the better than the other one, because the other one's a small amount of experience to up to all your troops, versus Raise the Meek. Penton third leg. Yeah, absolutely, Ricochet. Glad to help you, man. Well, let's just see how it goes. And if it, if it botches, we'll roll with it, because remember, we're going to make a better one after this anyway, and down, the, down the road. We're on Fenton. Good to go. Oh! Ooh. Oh! Shivering Death 1. I just found your channel from Turin's channel. I've been watching the Bannerlord content back to back. Keep up the good content. Thank you very much, Shivering Death. I really appreciate that, man. That's an awesome, awesome donation, dude. Will never fall. Maybe. We can't really reload, to be honest. Um, because I don't know where it is that we that we last saved. That is definitely a net loss. A little bit harder than what we did, so. Let's do, uh, I can make a 181. That might be a better idea. So thank you again, uh, Shivering Death. Thank you guys all very, very much for donations today, guys. I got one. Callard's memory. Callard's, Callard's. <laughs> oh, wait, what, what the hell? Uh, Mertian. Mertian's. Mertian's arm. Highland Fine Steel Blade. course. Why wouldn't that be the case? Why wouldn't that be the case? That's not the decorated one. Never mind, never mind. I don't even know which one that is. Oh, we have to back out. Memoirs of a Merton. Mertian. We got the War Razor Blade that we wanted earlier, too.
Where is it? Fucking search feature? <laughs> Are these blades unlocking that I just can't find? You too, Wolfguard. Thanks for jumping in, man. Saw you having a lot of fun all, all stream. Highland Fine Steel Blade. There it is. Look at that. Yeah, so it's a one-handed blade, that's why. Anytime, man, it is my pleasure. I'm surprised it's not in this menu. Well, let me see. Alex, you're right, man. It's so it's been like, cool guys, we did it. And then I'm like, where the fuck is the it? <laughs> okay, so where where is this thing? Where is this thing? The Mertian's arm, better swing speed, uh, lower cut by ten, better pierce, better length, better handling. Um, we we could just keep this weapon. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Um, we could just hold on to this. Um, and use it for now. I think that might be the better call. What do you guys think? I could use it as a civilian. Dude, good call, Mikowski. Let's find out if it does one shot. Who are you? What do you have? A lot of recruits? A lot of trash ass recruits? We've, we've loaded back in, so let's fix this up. You're in two, three. I want to keep as many trained warriors. I don't want to. I don't want them to die as clan warriors, even though that it technically is better to keep them as clan warriors for experience purposes. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, Foxman, please. You in three? Have another Foxman down. Three. Five. Perfect. Booty gum drops arrow. Um, this might be a little bit harder to fight, so we'll save. My wife is giving a ba a baby birth. Did I put him in three? Matt, you're freaking me out. Did I put him in three? <sighs> yeah. Thank you. What's happening, guys? I have a child for the first time in my life. I know, Ivan. I know. Soldiers! Shields for soldiers! Forward infantry! Armored infantry! 
Infants get moving! Move! Infantry! Move! Footman! Infants get moving! After me! Footman! Infantry! Make a shield wall! Soldiers! Forward! Footman! Move out! Yeah, Ricochet, there is a video explaining it. It's um on my channel. Here, I'll give it for you. I get you video. Oh, okay, no worries, no worries. I thought you were telling me, I'm like, man, I know. It's all right. I'm here with you. I'm here with you guys, together, so forever. All right, let's get everyone moving up. Okay, so they've taken this little gully here, which is actually kind of nice. Protect me. Okay. Yeah. Oh no! 21 damage! It's alright. I knew we were winning, that's why I kind of went a little, a little crazy there. <clears throat> Just left. Boxmen are all okay. Beautiful. Beautiful. Just taking heads. Taking heads. Only lost two guys. Uh, Principess, or Principess, which sucks. And then the Trained Warrior. You're my prisoner, dude. Whew! 55 whopping hard prisoners for that one, too. Um, let's just... He does. <laughs> he did, didn't he? You know, I used to be an adventurer once. Like, oh, okay, yeah, we get it, Dad. All right, Wythen has given birth to Dalian, huh? What is Dalian? Look at little Dillian! <laughs> He's so teeny! Little guy! Little guy! Um, Misfortune, or I Misfortune, I did just change the stuff. Teespring. I just changed all the prices down, but I feel like it didn't, it didn't, it didn't actually save them. Let me take a look. 
Yeah, if you do want to buy anything, you use the, the code STREAM on checkout, and it's like 50% off everything. Whoa, yeah, I didn't save it all. Nope, bag. Yeah, it didn't save like anything. That's boring swaggle. dollars for a ticket or a ticker? Why is it so expensive? Save. There we go. There we go. Now the prices should be updated properly. Sorry about that, guys. This one. Benjamin. Benjamin. Benja. Diane. There you go. Ben, you're in the game now. Benjamin. Benjamin. Benjamin, you're in the game. <laughs> there you go, Ben. If you see this auto compliant, that's all you, man. Try to do a Wait. Throws all good. Well, actually, I'll get the. I want to get them up. The, the lower dudes, I want to get up fast. I don't want them to get killed. Benjamin! 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 My, your kid's always in Chikin if he's in with you. And he will jump to being with you once you. Uh, whoa! Oh, whoops. Wrong place, that's why. Over to a keep. Oh god, it. stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Eat that crap. No, I could actually be okay with um, putting a shield in here now. They don't have a community or clan we can join. Uh, they do have their, their Discord and everything. We're winning so hard, my contract is just worth nothing. My income's coming in hard and heavy. Have other the brewer is really not giving me <laughs> perfect. Yeah, there's uh, there's forms and everything.
William Savoy, uh, Savory, I, no one blames you, man. <clears throat> oh. Notice four bandits will instantly fight while farming them, but 40 will just give up and you don't have the option to fight them anyway. It needs change. Yeah, I know. I, I understand that. I'm like, oh, I'll just kill these guys real quick. And like, no, 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 we don't want to fight you. Like, but I don't want to fight you. So we have a kid, and I might now make her, um, I might have her lead a caravan. I got married in the game. Take a look. Wifeween. Which sounds like my wifey. Two o'clock, three three fifteen into the stream, so we'll probably be ending here pretty soon. Here, if there's any cool fights going on, send in, send in, send in. Hmm. Nope, no growing up mod. Although that would probably have been a cool idea. Yeah, we are. Yeah. Samus of the Batanians has been taken. Oh, the Philophilophathus. 26 range, man. Like, what's it with these guys? So, well, let's go get a shield. And that shield, um, I don't really want to focus too much on it, but the point of having the shield is... Stop it. Is to increase my one-handed skill. Because right now, our, our actually, our two-handed isn't even that high, to be totally honest. But we're not gaining skill points fast enough, and we're still at level 14. There's a huge jump in skill point requirements from level 14 to from 13 to 14, then 14 to 15. And because of that, you'll notice that a lot of your characters are kind of stuck in that level range. So it forces you to use things that you don't have any skill for to try and increase that. So I mean, we could even do throwing if we wanted, but um, do the small hideout. Sure. Where's the small hideout? All right, small hideout indeed. Oh, man. You too, Drago. Thanks for jumping in, man. Ciao, Farcello. Fartello. Very Come well. On. This is the fucking longest sword I've ever seen in my life. Longer even than mine. Oh, man. Aha, mountain bitch. Is that? Oh, it's a cavalry broadsword. Which is probably my favorite weapon, to be honest. I love these things. So sick looking. There's, yeah, see? Love the scabbard on them. We could use a horse, but I mean... I don't feel like... Eating. A fine commoner's tunic at the right price, four hundred. Which quest, Justin? Oh, uh, they don't always require. Uh, if they're that small, they typically don't have our quest corresponding. Well, thanks for jumping in, Cadleo. More pickled warriors. Let's just jump over here. We'll, we'll grab ourselves a shield real quick. And we'll kind of end our stream on that. That's a pretty good note, I think, to end on. We have a lot of fun to do. We crafted our sword. Okay, Anwar. You're just a, a horse eater over there. Hopefully we get into more sieges and some more fights now. I mean, I could, yeah, put myself on a horse and start running around. That would give us a ton of skill. Oh, I love these Highland shields. Take a look. 
Oh, well, that's the small one. I don't like this one. I like this one. No. There's a bigger one I like. Oh, maybe it's the Highland Large Shield. <laughs> Alright, Lung Green, thanks for jumping in, man. Thank you very much for your donation, too. That's a good point, Andy Salter. Yeah, you know what? What we do? That might be what we do. That might be what we do. Might be, might be, might be what we do. Might be what we do. Might be what we do. Take a look at that sweet saddle. <laughs> so I think we'll look around more for another one later. Oh, for a different shield. Uh, the one on these guys is a little bit sicker. Pick, maybe, I thought the Pickwear had a much bigger shield. Skirmisher shield. Am I, am I all my old sworn dead? I don't know. Yeah, I guess not. I guess it's not the biggest shield that I thought it was. That's just a bunch of hog swoggle. No problem, Colonel Burton. Yeah, we're, we're ending it right now. We'll be jumping back on again uh, Saturday and Sunday for some more fun. And I do have a giveaway that I'll do. Um, we'll be doing that um, on Saturday and Sunday. Let's do... Um, That's fine then. Okay, that looks sick. What time Saturday? 11 a.m. Pacific Daytime. How close to the own kingdom? Kind of close. We didn't do a lot of fighting today like I wanted to do. Um, but we will kind of pick that up. <clears throat> and I think we'll take my wife and make her lead a caravan now. But now that she's given, given us a child... The child will now age, and we will uh, it, it'll uh, continue to be our next soldier. All right, guys. So let me go ahead and save this and give some thanks out here. We had quite a lot of donations here today, so let me take a look at this. So uh, it's just going in reverse here. Shivering Death One, thank you very much for your twenty dollars donation. Cincinnati, thank you for your donation as well, brother. I hope you're safe out there. Um, Elliot, for your ten dollars donation. Paris, for the double donation, the five and the two uh, earlier before that. Thank you very much, man. Uh, Galahan for your five dollars, uh, which is actually also for the ten dollar too. They were back to back, so fifteen in total. Uh, Como topic for your five dollar donation. Dumb, dumb, diddy, dumb for your six point two dollar donation. Uh, Lund Green for the massive twenty dollar donation. Uh, Lunith for the five dollar, and then Mangran X, or also known as Ryan, for the total nine dollar or er, eight dollar. Ooh, five plus four is nine dollar donation. <laughs> and then Aradom to open up the stream with the two dollar donation. So guys, thank you very, very much. Like I always say, I really, really appreciate it, guys. Um, Stephen Lee, like I said, donated $50 just last weekend for another key. So we'll be giving that away here on Saturday or Sunday. I do have some more Calor videos. I've got a top 10 video I've got planned for Warhammer. Uh, it's like Warhammer. It's like Total War Warhammer slash Fantasy at the same time. It, it'll be a fun one. It's not a serious one like a lot of my other ones are. This will just be kind of like a fun, let's have, some, let's have a good time style top 10. You too, Luna. Thanks for jumping in. Hi from Turkey, hello! How are you, Ozan? It's okay, Frank. We'll be back here on Saturday and Sunday at 11 a.m., man. They still have them. They're in there, Ivan. They're in, they're in here. Somewhere. These things are really light. 3.5? They're pretty sick. Oh, like some shields are just so fucking heavy. You too, Border Collie. All right, Anwar, you have a good one too, dude. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching here today. As always, have a good one and take care.